It's a big feeling of accomplishment when you feel like you've learned a machine well enough that you can fix it and knowing that that equipment can save lives. So it's definitely, it's a rewarding job, I think. We teach our folks how to maintain, repair, calibrate, install, and modify one approved medical equipment in our medical treatment facilities. Some of the equipment we use is the x-ray machines, the mobile x-ray, the film processor for that. We use defibrillators. Infusion pumps, vital signs monitors, uh, working into infant incubators, hypohypothermia units, dental chairs, anesthesia. Basically anything you can find in a hospital we fix. In the past, if something was wrong with medical equipment, you'd normally have to replace an entire board, but we're trained here to troubleshoot to find out if it's an uh, actual component. Blocks one and two, you tend to learn the basics of electronics and principles, and then block three is when you finally start working on equipment. So by then, you're pretty much ready to go, and they teach you everything you need to know. At this course, we also have to incorporate anatomy and physiology. The biggest reason why is in order for us to troubleshoot something, we need to be able to duplicate the symptom that the operator was doing on the particular patient or the test that they were running. So we need to know how to operate it. We need to know how they were applying that piece of equipment in order to accurately troubleshoot the symptom that occurred. We can go anywhere around the world, whether it be the hospitals over in Germany to a field hospital in Afghanistan. We can de definitely work out of any hospital, wherever it is.